So in this tutorial, we're going to look how to create this river man, but it is not just a river cut in the ground. Also, you can notice um, we have a nice um, cutting through, but challenge when you start creating erosion, the path start covering. So we'll see how you can mask that just inside the path so we can create uh, water still fill up if you um, can get like water lever let's take it down and you can see we still have a very nice going path in the water however when we come closer to the edge you'll notice right there we have a very interesting distribution and this is we're creating a um, river delta and that one a little bit more challenging but it is still be nice to create with the beach and spread this kind of water you can see a depth going on different levels okay let me try again like right there you can see how it's kind of spreading out more creating natural delta look of course you can add and it will look additional if you want to add additional you can do this way but this way uh, will look how we can blend this different type and give it additional um more natural look for the river come to maybe to the ocean or lake or some other area specifically combined with this and of course um, as we work with this we'll look on some creating maps maybe for your um, game or your 3d render whatever you're going to use for to create a plot or um, material distribution maps first let's go work on our layout so I'm going inside the layout right here we'll go to set current and I'm going to actually create larger size so I have more map to work with okay next we'll go to create a new layout we'll take a line and we'll just go to um lines right there you know, maybe create something like that so we'll create this kind of river we'll go double time click open let's go to reduce fallout no maybe two kilometers we'll go set curve i think this is will kind of work okay um couple things maybe okay let's go to adjust so i'm just going to set little bit them smooth so because our river does not need to have this hard kind of edges okay right there same just smoothing curves okay we also use the breakup of this let's go to edit them I'll scale and roughness probably about same so this is our basic river if we want to think we can increase make thickness but i think this will work just fine so and right here we have our layout um, next let's create a generator we'll go create per noise and this will be kind of all our terrain will apply to this so we'll open and let's modify we'll have it um mountains maybe no but let's go to the hills a little bit smaller size so we have it more great on this one um i also want to switch to below so it's pop up better on these ones uh, let's take it down and bring our elevation and the step is down just overall create kind of small mountains that we're going to reuse um next we want to add some gradient to this mountain so i want them to be higher and as they're going they will decrease because i want to this river go through this and go inside the ocean and that combination is what i want to do for that one we'll go create a gradient location and okay let's disable gradient and the gradient probably you know let's go to kind of like this maybe right there Okay, and we can play a little bit more with width, see which one works better. X, 
actually right there maybe okay let's go take um now this gradient and apply as a main map so you can see we have it almost going inside and going into our river also you know what let's go take um Oh, this current, you know what, and just bring a little bit more far in. Run this way. Yeah, I think it's work about right. Okay, so we'll go back, preview river, and we can adjust afterwards. So now we take also um, our river, what we have it, and we want place um, inverter for this select it and i don't want invert on inside because if you go on layout you actually can invert values inside i don't want to do this right now because i won't use it in the future but we'll go this way and add to our river okay so it's look so far we kind of created a river going down we can go click preview and you can see we have a river going in a valley um it's not the best one looking, but we again, we'll look for the principle. So let's look this way. And uh, let's actually go back and modify a couple things for this. So the one will go in advance and let's, you know what, because it's bigger, let's go just increase slightly size. Yeah, I think this one will look slightly bare. Well, you know what, I'll work okay. Maybe leave it presence and pop slightly elevation up and increase stepness. So just kind of play a little bit more. We'll see how it will come up. We may even come back after and readjust. And the one thing or only what I don't like, if you look carefully on this river, it is fine, but when it's come in, it's coming as a string. I'm not necessarily think it's what will help nice with our river so what we're we going it's change this so let's go take this and put it in our erosion and this is actually it's help us to adjust so we'll go to channel we'll pop up this rock hardness carrot segment we'll pop so you can see we kind of applied um, things I don't like it, it is applied to all. I want just to the end. So we'll go take gradient. Oops, actually this one gradient and apply to the mask. So you can see a mask can apply there, except now we need to use an inverter. So let's go through the inverter and going to the mask. Now we have the erosion applied to right place. Okay, right here, that's repositioning. And it's still kind of, it's, uh, we're getting lost. So let's go back and add equalization to this. Okay, so it's equalized, but same things. Let's add gradient to this. So it's equalized actually through the inverter, sorry. So it's equalized just in the way I want it. And if we're going to log preview, open. In this case, we can see how we can increase or play a little bit more with the distribution. So you can see it's kind of almost like with edge. Let's spread around. Okay, amount and set rock hardness. So I'm just watching for this area. So it's apply kind of nicely on this case. Um, we have more interesting output to our river. So if you look on the river, now we have it almost river go in. And when is the kind of going inside the water? Now we have more like daily spreading around, kind of going in different areas. Again, we can add additional lines to this if we need it. And if we're going inside, we can add more layouts, 
combine additional layouts here and then this way it will help us also spread um, other things beside adding layouts you always can go back and add additional like Voronoi so let's do this in the next portion of the tutorial